Hi, in this lesson we will learn how to make a table in the editable mode in SE16N. As SE16N, we make use of this transition code to modify, update, delete the record of any table if the table setting allow us to do that. Here take example of two different table on the left hand side. Here this table is in the editable mode. Here you can modify the data, we can delete or add the record. But on the right hand side there is one more table and the table setting of this table not allowing us to modify the data even after logging into SE16N. So this we can do in case of emergency with the help of debugging. So let's log into the system and check what the scenario. So here if I go to SE16N and first I will show custom table. So here you can see the maintain entries checkbox is selected. If I execute this, we can see by default data into the editable mode. We can modify the record, we can add a new record here, or we can delete the record from here. Because this table ZVP AK, if you check in the SE16, SE11 or SE12, in the delivery maintenance tab, here we can see the display maintenance is allowed. That's why we are able to edit the data into SE16N. But let's check some other standard table will be AK. So here the display maintenance is not allowing us to modify the data. Okay, allow it restriction. So if you go to SE16N with the table will be AK, see we cannot select the checkbox. Okay, and if you go inside, this all will be in the display mode. We cannot modify the data. So, how to modify this data in case of emergency? So, what we have to do on this initial screen, go to debugging mode by pressing slash H, enter, execute. Go to desktop 3. Here in this program, there is a structure GT. GD, this structure contains multiple fields and here we have to mark two fields as X and the fields are SAP edit and edit. If you see here two fields, SAP edit and edit we have to mark as X. Okay, so I will go to desktop 3 again and what I will do, I will go to change mode and SAP edit equal to X and the second field GD hyphen edit this also I will make as X. Okay, now if I execute, so we can see the same record now in the editable mode. You can also delete the record from here, or if you want to modify, modify the record and add a new record. So here my requirement is I want to change the date. So what I want to do here, I will make as 30032017. And for the second one also, I want to change this date on the same date. 2017. Okay, to record I modified. And if I save here, you can see change rows 2. So order number I have changed 1 or 2, 1 and 2. Okay, now if I go back, go back one more time, then come into SC16 and we be AK, select only 10 records and execute. Okay, so let me enter the number on the initial screen so that system will show the modified record 1 and 2. So if I execute here, see the date is here 30.032017. Now again, this is into display mode because this time I have not gone through the debugging mode. Okay, so this concept we can use for any table in case of emergency development system. If you develop any system, if you want to modify data and the table setting is not allowing us to modify the data, so you can simply go to debugging mode and mark those fields gd hyphen sap edit and gd hyphen edit as x, then we can make this table as the edit table, even though table setting not allowing us to modify the data. So in this way, we're done with this session. Thank you.